So the Referee Academy has been running for about the last two years now. Um, and what it is, is we've got about 15 young referees um, who are pretty much our up and coming referees, our best and brightest. Um, and similar to how players would, we've brought them into the academy um, and we're providing them with a number of training. So we've got about eight or 10 sessions per year, um, which is something a bit different to what they'd usually get. So it's not just about understanding the laws of the game and the refereeing side. It's a bit more about understanding football in general. Um, for example, we've had a couple of sessions with players and coaches from the local leagues to come and share their story and give their side of it. Um, we also talk a lot about the off the field stuff. So it's not just about being a really good referee on the field, it's also important to be a good person off the field. Uh, and there's a lot of bleed between those two as well. Uh, so tonight has been about running the academy referees through um, some training programs for running drills, creating situations like in a match. Um, these training drills we do to learn our skills as referees, like players practice their skills, it's not just about running. And um, we get players in that can create those situations. Generally international tournaments that's possible, but here in South Australia resourcing is hard. So it was great that um, the development squad was able to come and uh, provide situations. I think they really enjoyed it as well. And um, the referees really appreciated being able to practice their skills thanks to them. So we um, are using brand new technologies, uh, which is so exciting um, using the resources that we've got. We haven't seen this sort of technology used and here in South Australia, I don't think I believe it's been used in Australia. Um, having the benefits of being able to do that and have live coaching right here, right now, is it's world class, absolutely world class. So these referees are being exposed to the absolute best coaching, best technology that goes around. So I think some of the benefits of the Referee Academy for the last two years have been uh, things like getting interviews from MPL coaches and players to be able to develop our understanding of the game from running drills like this where we can get live video feedback from coaches. There's just been such a different uh, number of experiences we've been able to have to <laughs> improve the way we referee. Oh, coaches in the academy, like the likes of Michelle and Daniel Elder and Matthew Cream, they've benefited my improvement through the season because I was a young, shy person when I started and now being one of the only females out here, it's really improved my development, and especially for Michelle because she is a female. I've um, worked closely with her, and seeing them on the national panel, it's inspired me to go further through that and getting expert coaching from them. I mentioned before, a big part of the academy is understanding where referees sit in the sort of the, uh, the sphere of football. Um, and what their role is and I think working with the players tonight helps us understand that. Um, so for them to see us out here tonight uh, trying something a bit new and trying to learn and develop a bit more is, is a really great thing.